This is a plot on the 23rd of March 2012. I've um, extended the base of the dais so I can put the big IBC water containers on. I've put a nice little plot number on my shed. Painted most of the shed green. I've um, put some planks on the uh, one of the doors. Haven't got round to putting planks on the other door yet. I've moved the pile of wood from there and put the wheelbarrows there, nicely padlocked. There's a um, a uh, compost heap there, and I've moved some of the soil down to the edge here just to make it a bit more level. I've um, planted some more roses and um, black currant bushes in. There's Swan Lake, um, Dorothy Perkins, all of these, uh, the um, gooseberries are just coming out into, into bud. Climbing Rose uh, Aloha. The um, gooseberries are captivators. Climbing Rose the Garland. There we are. Another gooseberry. Another gooseberry. Climbing Rose Glory Dijon. Another, another gooseberry and we come on to the black currants. There's last year's golden showers, climbing rose, this in bud. Black currant, falling jet. There's the Albertine rambler, a very vigorous um, rambling rose. Don't know, it's a pink rose. Another um, black currant bush, another black currant bush. Schoolgirl, there's a little rose, little climbing rose. <coughs> Another black currant bush. Ben Lomond black currant bush is coming out. New Dawn is a fairly vigorous um, climbing rose there. Another black currant. The um, late raspberries here seem to ha to be not that happy. Some of them seem to b the top half has died off. I'll have to hope it's not a virus. That's where I've put all the all the logs. I've planted some more um um late r raspberries there of given one of the um, IBC containers to my friend over the way, Terry and I've got one more to take up to the top there I've um, started on my um, the flowers of my fairy glen and in the cold frame there we've got some lupins to put in it after I've, uh, I've increased the height of the the soil level there. The pond seems very overgrown at the moment. I've got some um, ivy to put round it just to cover it. The um, frogs are fairly busy. I'm not sure. I should have some some baby tadpoles soon. The uh, rhubarb starting to come out again. That's the lupins and the foxgloves. I've planted some broad beans in the cold frame. Um, I've sprayed that area with, with um, Roundup to get rid of everything, including the old um, strawberry plants. I've moved the um, blueberries by the um, plum tree that's coming out very nicely. Everything's starting to bud. The uh, pear tree 
is coming out and seem quite as happy as the plum tree. The um, pigeons have eaten some of the shamrock and the um, wild strawberries are taking hold. That's the, uh, the um, I've um, killed off the chives because they're full of, of um, cooch grass and I couldn't get rid of the cooch grass even if I dug it up um, so I killed them off and up will come the bluebells I haven't um, got bluebells yet but I've made three beds of strawberry plants a huge amount of strawberry plants there based on the fact that you only should have um, no strawberry plant should be more than three years old so I'm going to get rid of one of these um, <coughs> strawberry plants one of these beds will be, be gone and only their little babies will be planted next year and I'll have to, have to rotate the thing the um, herb, herb garden's not looking too happy the um, thyme is not at all happy, and neither is the sage, but I suppose it will, will come back. The um, rosemary, however, is a very hardy herb, and that's coming up. The, uh, I've split the, the um, lamb mint into two pots, because I really like that. There's some chocolate mint that doesn't seem to have come up but the spearmint is, is looking very healthy and that's coming up the, uh, there's some other mint I think it's apple mint there it's not showing any signs at all and I've sprayed the grass in between so that's nicely dying Next door's done a great job on his plot. He's worked quite hard on it. The plot belongs to his daughter, but he does most of the work. I've um, made an attempt to um, get this um, ready so I can sow some peas, uh, but I'll have to get have to weed it. Those are some spare um, <coughs> green things that are could well use. I've asked the pigeon man to leave his pigeon poo. That's the pigeon man's pigeon place, but he leaves his pigeon poo here, or some of it. And that's it. That's my wonderful shed coming on. I won't show you around it because I haven't got a key to open it up here at the moment. But I've put a, a um, purling thing on. And that's reasonable. And that's the plot. It's not too much work. Most of it's been just grafting, not much planting yet, on the end of March. Bye.